April of 2023, Chicago rapper, 051 Kiddo, returned to the streets a different man. Draped in custom YM diamond chains, his return marked the beginning of a new chapter in his life. 15 years after joining the gang, and fresh off an 11 year bid, he was now crowned the one. This is the story of Chicago's top op, 051 Young Money Kiddo. Lavelle Adams, aka 051 Kiddo, aka Kiddo the Driller, was born November 8th, 1995. Raised in and around the Bronzeville area of Chicago, 051 Kiddo in an interview admitted to joining the gang by the age of 11. From 11 to 16, 051 Kiddo would gain the moniker Kiddo the Driller due to how active he was in the game. During this time, Lavelle Adams, aka 051 Kiddo, also made time to focus on his education, attending the prestigious Kenwood Academy for high school. In high school, Kiddo would officially join 051 Young Money. 051 Young Money is a renegade set in Chicago, which mainly consisted of Mickey Cobras and GDs, but also had some BDs and Blackstone members. 051 Young Money's territory was stretched from 48th and Drexel to 51st and St. Lawrence, but their main block being located on 51st and Cottage Grove. During this time, Kiddo will also become close friends with fellow 051 Young Money member Yarmel Williams, aka 051 Melly. And from late 2010 through his arrest in 2012, he, Melly, and the whole 051 Young Money set would be at war with rival street gang THF and eventually rapper Lil Dirk and his OTF 600 crew. Due to the death of rapper 600 LA Capone, and 051 Love Mark, OTF and 051 Young Money will remain entrenched in a bloody gang war, with shootouts and murders occurring to this day. In 2012, 051 Kiddo was charged with armed robbery with a firearm and sentenced to 21 years in prison. Originally, the rumor was Kiddo got caught doing a home invasion with two other individuals who got away and he refused to snitch, hence why receiving the max of 21 years on his first conviction. Others claim Kiddo had been on the police radar due to his involvement in a number of unsolved cases, and CPD used a relatively small burglary case to throw the book at him. Either way, many in the drill community consider this the last anyone will hear of the young driller Kiddo. During his time in jail, Kiddo would share a cell with, at the time, fellow up-and-coming rapper King Von. Von was from O-Block and closely aligned with both Lil Dirk OTF and the 600 and THF neighborhoods, making him and Kiddo sworn enemies. Given the odd nature of the two cellmates' arrangement, there were rumors that the two did fight at least once, but there are also people including Kiddo himself who said that him and Vaughn were close the whole time and even wrote letters and sent them to people on the outside together. In 2017, when King Vaughn was released from prison, rumors about Kiddo would again begin to come out. By then, the streets were praising Vaughn as the next guy to blow up from the BDs and stories like beating up a 051 Young Money cellmate would be used to further promote his street credibility. It would not be until early 2023 that 051 Kiddo will be released from prison after serving 11 years that we will hear his side of the story. By that time, 051 Young Money had taken a number of losses in the streets, and Kiddo would come back to the blocks he called home minus most of his friends. Despite the long hiatus due to prison, 051 Kiddo would dive head first into the still red hot Young Money 600 beef. And due to a number of different circumstances, the city he left had changed drastically. 
Most gangs by now had aligned themselves with O Block, 600, OTF, or Taytown. And those who didn't, like Tukaville, Taekwon World, and Jaro, have been left to fight against a growing city of black disciples. Though those groups also would have minor internal conflict, once the release of 051 Kiddo, being one of the last remaining members, he became Chirac's top op. Seizing on the notoriety, 051 Kiddo quickly began doing interviews and posting diss videos on social media. Kiddo also began dropping official music and vlogs on the Wolf Eye Visuals YouTube channel. On June 26, 2023, 051 Kiddo dropped his first official music video since being released from prison, entitled Don't Play With Us, followed by his next effort, No Interviews. Being Chicago's self proclaimed top op, 051 Kiddo placed himself in the crosshairs of the new crop of BD clicked up rappers, mainly from Taytown, O Block, and Welch World. A challenge young Lavelle Adams seems to be using to fuel his growing rap career. From young Driller to prison for the past 11 years to coming home one of the most respected gangsters in Chicago. This is the story of 051 Young Money Kiddo, aka Kiddo the Driller, Chirac's top op. It's your boy MRX El Guapo, Street Certified News. The street's most reputable source for urban media. Make sure you like, comment, and subscribe for more of our original content. We out.